Hey you guys, it's Sunshine Vibes with the High Vibrations. If y'all new to my channel, thank you for watching. If y'all returning, thank you for subscribing to your girl. Love and light to you all. I hope everybody is doing good. Okay, I wonder if y'all can see my... Okay, so I'm going to tap right into these messages and see what I have for you all today. Call on the highest order of protection, Archangel Michael. Give me clear messages for my collective. Nothing but the nine messages from the highest white light. Okay, angels, ancestors, divine guides, divine angels, divine ancestors. Give me one corner for the current energy that surrounds my collective. Deep dark sea mermaid. Find solutions in the unknown places in the darkness. Yeah, so some of you all could be like, um, no GPS, I find a way type of energy, right? So it's like you just going. You, yeah, you are un like anyone else your co contradictions complexes are interesting yeah so whatever you are doing is very interesting here you are not like everybody else now you're independent and free you have new skills advanced training rapid improvements after sadness okay happiness is coming it's time to become a great leader oh we change is a natural good and yes it can hurt so yeah some of you are going through some type of powerful change here and it just seems like you're finding a way without a you know, GPS. You're like a, a council without Google out here, right? This is something new. Like, everybody can't do this. Shape shift the energy. You are shape shifting. There's something. Oh, wait. Confirmation. You are shape shifting some type of energy that was sent to you, I just heard. So somebody's sending you an energy? Yeah, because soon I cut the deck. A loyal guardian. A magical protector is there for you. Somebody could be 33. But you're somebody who's sweet, right? You've been reborn. Okay. So no GPS, you'll find a way. <laughs> and I feel like you got people like, confused on where you're going so you have people trying to follow you down a path it's giving me um it's giving me the uh the energy of uh, the wizard of Oz. okay the whole time she was on her path she had her dog okay which is god backwards so you have people trying to uh, follow you on a path that you don't even know where you're going. Uh, Spurs said, good luck with that. <laughs> good luck with that because you're literally walking in the dark, okay? Find solutions in unknown places in the darkness. You're finding solutions in unknown places in the dark. And it's going to be hard for these people to be able to find solutions through the same unknown places as you because their unfamiliar is not your unfamiliar, meaning somebody else's comfort zone uh, may not be your comfort zone, okay? Something that makes you uncomfortable may not make somebody else uncomfortable. Uh, give me more for this energy. What's going on with the current energy? Okay, we have vow in reverse. Yeah, strategy, planning, prediction. So you strategizing something here when it comes to your parenthood, our support, your creativity, your friends. You could be investing in something. Somebody wants to apologize because they see you ready for something. This could be somebody you had an alliance with that made a promise with you, that wanted to bind you. That's furious. Somebody is so upset because you're getting justice and everything's on schedule. They wanted you to be scared in this own, own unknown place, but yeah, blind in reverse. They couldn't blind you. They couldn't bind you. Wow. Like I said, Wizard of Oz energy. It's giving like you went on a journey, you went on a path, you started meeting all these people to distract you off your path, but you still had your dog. <laughs> so you was never blind. Yeah, self-love. I can't make this shit up. But you was never blind, collective. So people wanted you to feel like you was blinded. You didn't know where you was going. Okay, but you knew where you was going the whole time. Maybe you don't know. 
Okay? Yeah, indulgence. Maybe you don't know. I feel like you don't self... You don't indulge in something her endorsement somebody wanted to tip, tempt you and bribe you into doing something this is somebody that could have been like protesting the itch against you and you walking through the unknown here i just heard yeah fright somebody wanted you scared depressed going through whatever you was going through as you was going on the path her what yeah, collaboration. These people could have wanted, these people could have made a vow to collaborate, but when they realized that this hoping, praying, wishing, whatever they was worshiping to, it wasn't working. It wasn't blinding you. It just made you be in this energy of like loving yourself more, watering your garden her, because she has like flowers everywhere. So you just watering yourself. You're not overindulging. You, you're not afraid. Yeah, you're okay. You're stable. I can't make this shit up. What is going on? Yeah, nightmare. Somebody literally wanted to curse your... Your path, your journey, because they wanted you to be scared of it. Yeah, stop. Somebody really needs to stop. Somebody could have wanted you to be stagnant here. Take a break. Somebody's like, take a break from what you're doing. <laughs> but you're being a charity... Okay, you're very kind. You're persevering through something here. I can't make this shit up. Perseverance. You're persevering, collective. Seven. That's a God's number here. You're persevering, overcoming some type of challenge. And this is disturbing a lot of people. Because you're calm and you ended something. Okay, you're not homeless. You're not you're not working out of pride. You're a blessing. You're a coach. Something about your ideas. What did I say? You're not a curse. You're a blessing. You have fucking bright ideas. Somebody wanted to curse you. Curse your profession. Right, turn that water off for me, please. Okay. What's going on with the energy? Let's see. Personal profession. I'm gonna pull something from my deck. Yeah, somebody's very mad. Okay, somebody's very mad that they couldn't curse you, they couldn't bind you, they couldn't pray to something. Somebody is praying to entities. Yeah, fake energy, energy warning. So this person was warned to stay out your energy, right? The moment this person tried to pray on your downfall and blind you and bind you, okay. Somebody was aware, like stop, because you were still in this energy of self love. Yeah, will of fortune her. You're still, you still have good karma. Whoever you are, you cleared out your karma. I heard, I just heard you clearing out your karma. You got good karma her. Yeah, and you're aware of the fuck shit that's going on behind the scenes because you're walking through the unknown. Ooh, I'm into man and woman, Lola. So this could be somebody that's into the same sex. Yeah, first said thank you. You're part of the 144,000, you guys. You have a bigger calling over your life at this time. You are being called to focus on your paths, finding solutions in unknown places. This is what you're here to do. To uh, uplift the collective or uplift your community here. To show that you can persevere, don't stop. You're not, you're not having nightmares, okay? You have a lot of people that is competing with you because they want to end your destiny. They do not like this energy yes spell work i can't make this up leave him alone he doesn't want you so evidently this is a third party situation okay you guys this could be a third party somebody you was dealing with somebody really wants you to leave somebody alone yeah but i'm in love with you but this person's in love with you okay ancestors protection dreams something about your dreams choices have consequences yeah this person has been doing heavy ass spell work okay spirit is saying change because people hate you People, people hate the fact that you are changing, that you are on a journey here. And this is, yeah, it's bringing somebody's mental disorder. So what it, what they try to bind you to, they are now binded to, right? Because you can't dibble and dabble in uh, something you don't know anything about, right? You knew what was going on, okay? I feel like these people didn't know. 
they didn't know where you was going. This is why I said, no GPS, you'll find a way. So they're like, where are you going? And you don't even know. People could have thought you were stupid, dumb, I just heard. But no, Spurs said you're very wise. You started listening to your intuition. You started gaining more mental clarity the moment you started connecting with spirit, right? And you got these people out of your energy. You're aware. Like I said, it's giving okay, yellow brick road. Stay focused on the yellow brick road energy. Stay focused, collective, because you are almost at your goal. You have a lot of people trying to distract you off of your purpose. But you have your dog with you. Some of y'all could have a dog. But, you know, you have God with you wherever you go. Give me one card. Who is this that is trying to cause uh, my collective to be binded? Yeah, 33. Somebody could be 33. This could be an older man. Somebody's very concerned about your journey. I can't make this shit up. Somebody's concerned about your journey. You've been in high honor. This is a false person. A main female that's in poverty. <sighs> yeah, I can't make this up. Despair reverse. You're not in despair. Okay? Somebody wanted you to be in despair about your parents, about your journey. No. You're a, di you're a privileged lady, right? At a distance. Like I said, um, the moment you walked away from people, places, and things, you started realizing who you were at a distance. You're held in high honor. <laughs> and you was dealing with some type of false person here. Why is Distant Horizon and Prince Lady? Yeah, family room in reverse. This could even be family that are like doing things behind the scenes to cause delays in your journey here because you're changing. Somebody doesn't want you to get married. This could be a, like a, a community. Okay, we have mature woman and thief. This is a woman here. Like I said, this is a woman. This woman could be suffering from bad health here. Something significant that this woman could have did in July or June. June 24th could be significant. Okay. But somebody is definitely going through some type of karma here. Okay, I feel like the tables have turned. You're the one that's going through the good karma. This this woman is going through bad karma, and this woman's concerned. Why is bad health a thief? Yeah, because of your occupation. You could be working on something, her. Yeah, and you're running right into great fortune. Somebody is really concerned about your money and your work and your love life. Hell no. Okay, somebody's really concerned about your love life and your money, her. And this could be, like I said, a woman that did magic, okay, based off of, of a masculine energy that is in love with you. And this woman is like in a mental disorder. Clarify this mature woman. Yeah, this woman is watching you. This woman's focused on you. Fascinating, right? This woman is like her eyes is on you. She's watching you. Because someone has an offer on the table here and somebody is pretending and still living beyond their means. Why somebody is avoiding someone here? Yeah, I can't make this up. Somebody that wanted to trap somebody. Pregnancy, money, short strings. This could be somebody's child's mother. Yeah, this woman's in denial here. Not facing the truth. Like I said, living beyond their means. Something about cleansing your energy, clearing your space. You're removing negative energy here. Okay, this woman... Somebody, like I said, definitely could have been dealing with a third party with download, dirty little secret there. But you're protected by Archangel Michael. If somebody is trying to weigh someone down, but somebody is definitely done. They're they're done with this situation. They're done with this karmic because somebody was trying to steal something from someone, I believe. And this woman is is upset because she's trying to have you in despair and the mental disorder, and it all backfired. You're persevering, okay? This woman's intimidated by a twin flame journey here because somebody's desiring you and they're cutting somebody out for her. Cause somebody really in love with you but this is a woman that has to understand she's a karmic third party lesson somebody wants to negotiate with a divine film because they're realizing something yeah i can't make this up twin flame they're realizing that they are married you're their murdered soul right they have this magnetic pull towards you and they just want to cut this woman out 
yeah somebody could want to talk to you get on the same page because somebody's on the verge to explode somebody could want to move with you move you in somewhere but somebody got unconditional love for you and they want to have babies they want to start a family like it's a lot it's a lot going on behind the scenes or yeah your intuition the high priest your intuition's been telling you this like hey you know yeah a judgment that somebody's under judgment When it comes to a partnership, because somebody was trying to steal something. Instead of just following their own path, <laughs> this person's too busy watching you find solutions in unknown places. Like somebody's like, How do you do that shit? How do you action? I mean, you take an action, her. This is like my life a movie type of energy, okay? Six of gems. You're very generous. So somebody thought they could take something from you because you are generous here. But ate a raindrop, somebody walked away. They used their intuition when it comes to some type of competition that was going on behind the scenes. Somebody wants to show you compassion because they see you focus on your priorities. This woman was just like too focused on, like Spurda saying this woman could have had this man, but this woman was too focused on you and your path. Yeah, your journey, the journey. Three of lightning. I'm hearing if the shoe fit, then wear that bitch. Okay? This woman couldn't walk the mile in your shoes. The high priest, you already knew. Knew something, her. Somebody is definitely woke. You listen to your intuition when it came to something, and you moved away from a situation. Yeah, because you know you a leader, master of lightning. You're a leader, her, collective. And you're achieving something. Seven of gems. Yeah. Five of gems. This woman's in need. Okay, this woman wanted to hold on to this masculine because she needs something. But this masculine's ready to take a leap of faith for her. And walk away. Start to have a new beginning with you. Okay, yeah. Homecoming in reverse. This woman's whole foundation is falling apart. She could be homeless, losing a home. But somebody... Yeah, so somebody could be really homeless, losing a home. But what I see here is somebody was unwilling to do any shadow work, okay? Instead of accepting things for what they was, not trying to change the situation, because it's giving me somebody was, you know, creeping around and they fell in love with somebody here. And now this woman is in deep regret because she couldn't take something from someone. Someone's like, they, they don't have any clarity when it comes to a situation, okay? Somebody's judgment is really cloudy. Like, they are mentally, really, mentally disturbed, okay? Somebody's no longer holding on to old memories here. Somebody's not willing to do any shadow work on themselves. And this woman feels like she can't even defend herself anymore. Something about intellect. This woman wasn't even using her brain when it came to this man charming her charming reverse this man is like not interested in this woman anymore then i have the devil at the bottom of the deck this woman wanted somebody restricted okay not having the strength to move forward having anxiety okay but somebody is taking the time like to breathe somebody's not carrying a burden they're going towards wish fulfillment and somebody just feels defeated because somebody seek the truth this emperor, he wants to take up space. Like he wants to come towards, he wants to make a choice here because he feel like he lost something when it comes to an adventure. Cause they see how, this this emperor sees how determined you are. Okay, give me one more. And yeah, this woman, she is just unwilling to do the shadow work, okay? But this woman's watching you find solutions in unknown places. But like I said, can't even walk a, walk a mile in your shoes. And you're in the dark, right? But you're of light. You, He did say, let there be light, right? As I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. So you're walking through this valley with all these different monsters and creatures, as you can see. And this woman is just very concerned. Like, how do you do it? And yeah, inspiration, because you're inspiration. It's a lightning. Like I said, you are of, of light, so... You're gonna find solutions in the dark because you're of light. You're like a, 
a lottery <laughs> to the unknown here. Yeah. Curiosity. Somebody's very curious about your perspective here. Give me one more. Yeah, two of gems, but you're focused on your priorities. This is why you're getting wish fulfillment. This is why this woman feels defeated. Because you actually seek the truth. This emperor actually seek the truth when it came to his choices and feel like he lost out. By not taking this journey. Okay, but somebody wants to take this journey here. Yeah, this man could be real practical, okay? But this man understands that he's under judgment. Yeah, and somebody wants to have a victory with you. Because somebody's like, you're a trophy. They look at you like a trophy. Yeah. Okay. Somebody was playing her. But they couldn't play with you because you went through an ascension. You ended up in a cycle her. This is why you're not in despair. Yeah, abundance. Nine of gems. I can't make this up. You're being ascended. You're being elevated her. Appearance of light. Now you're going on an adventure. Somebody wants you to have anxiety. They just want to restrict. They want to restrict someone from coming towards you on this journey. Yeah, going towards fulfillment. But somebody is in and out of cycle anyway. Will of fortune at the bottom of the day. Cycles. Because somebody sees that you're protected. They want to surrender because they see you working hard. They want to partner with you. Because they seek the truth. Somebody feels defeated. <sighs> This woman did not think he was going to even persevere. This woman wanted you to fail. This woman prayed. This group of people prayed for you to fail. So this fast one wouldn't follow you on this path, on this journey. Give me one card. I can't make this up. Power. The power of love is like a magnet drawing cells together. This is why you, were just, you didn't fail. Because <laughs> the power of manifestation, okay, lies within your heart chakra, right? Adopt love. This woman wanted to be with someone because of their finances. Yeah, this is why somebody wants to commit to you. And a commitment is an important factor to achieve a successful relationship. Somebody really feel like they could be successful with you. It's like giving me power, couple energy. Yeah, somebody's in their emotions. Look deep within your emotions. True love. I can't make this up. True love comes when you least expect it. This person is realizing, okay, this is my true love. This came out of nowhere. Somebody didn't think that. <laughs> that this will happen, but it came out of nowhere. Yeah, enlightenment. And you enlighten this person to true love. With enlightenment, there is no separation. Okay, no recognize that we are, we recognize that we are one with the divine. Yeah, this person is recognized they're connected with, with listen to me, they're connected with spirit. Cupid at the bottom of the deck, attraction and love. I can't make this up. Somebody's getting out of signs. I'm hearing that song, uh, you're the one for me, you're the one for me. What song is that, y'all? <laughs> oh yeah, you're the one for me. This karmic is doing too much. This karmic does too much for attention. Okay, give me one for it. What does uh, this masculine want to say to my collective? I can't make this shit up. I love you. This masculine is in love with you. Give me one more for it. What does this nice one wants to say? Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. So this masculine can't get you off their mind. You know, it's on my mind. I lost myself for a little while. See, this masculine is feeling this mirror twin flame soul connection. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. I'm so attracted to you. I left when I saw you with someone. It's time for me to heal now. I love you unconditionally. Yeah. See, this definitely could have been like a third party situation. This person realized, you know, you wasn't going to sit back and be an option. So when they saw you with somebody, they left. But this person already has somebody. Yeah, my life is not to, as together as it seems. I replay our conversations over and over. I'm starting to understand our connection. This person's like, we will be together again, Divine Film. <laughs> this person's like, yeah, you don't get away. You're not getting away from me. They don't want you to go anywhere. 
I'm hearing baby don't go. Uh -huh, you've been searching for someone you can share that special love me. <laughs> Computer love? Did you meet this person on the internet? Oh Lord. <laughs> or this person can feel like y'all connection is so strong telepathically. It's like computer love. You hear me? <laughs> yeah. Promise of the future. Decision. Somebody's making a decision here. They're making a decision to go towards their future. Give me one for it. Blender. Yeah, because you real sweet to somebody here. Yeah, so you're giving somebody a positive outlook on life. You make somebody feel whole. Yeah, relax, go and relax. This is why somebody wants to surrender and come towards you because they see you being generous. You're focusing on your priorities here. You have a childlike expression, but you, somebody, you're making somebody reflect. Yeah, because you're nurturing, okay? Empress energy. You can have kids. Like I said, this person when have kids with you. You know, you're very nurturing, caring, and loving and kind. Yeah, somebody wants to embrace a journey with you. Come on, for it. Yeah, personal transformation. Because they see you going through a personal transformation. And the divine supports you. You're being empowered. And you're achieving something. You're a blessing. You're in harmony. You're healing. You have courage. And you're going towards your wish fulfillment here. And you're determined. You're, you have some type of new beginning here. Yeah, spiritual practice. Somebody wants to go on this powerful transformation with you. Innocence. Because they see you're really innocent. And you're protected. They see how protected you are. <laughs> Somebody's like, yeah, I'm going where the protection is, baby. Because <laughs> this woman is like showing this masculine, like, okay, I see who, I see where I need to be. Okay, somebody's like, I see where I need to be. I need to be where the energy is reciprocated. I shouldn't have to do all of this just for you to love me. I'm hearing, baby, don't go. <laughs> somebody's begging somebody not to go. Yeah, you know, nine, nine, nine. But this phase is over. Okay, thank the past for lo your lessons and leave it where it belongs, so you can achieve the best of the life that is still waiting to be fulfilled by all of you. Yeah, you're learning your lesson. Oh, we shit. Nine, 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 nine. So you all could be seeing nine, nine, nine heavy like crazy. It is time to get to work of the realization of your soul mission in life. You have a higher purpose in this life that is yours and only yours to fulfill. Unleash your true power. I'm courageous. I'm telling you. This masculine is understanding, like, he has to get on this journey. He has to get on this path because he knows he is destined for greatness. Or you know you are destined for greatness. It is time to, to follow this yellow brick road to go on this journey with you. Somebody's, somebody's ready. Yeah. 18. You are both open-minded and open-hearted. And your ambition is to leave this world better than you found it. Ensure that your goals are aligned with the collective need and with the highest good of all. I am kind-hearted. See? <sighs> this this man's about to take a journey, right? He sees your kind. This woman is like, she's mad, y'all. She's mad. And this man's like, I can't take this no more. This man's like, he cannot take it. He cannot take it. And this woman is like trying to play victim, but this woman is unwilling to do any work on herself, shadow work or anything. Yeah, like something about kids. Somebody could be using kids. Yeah, but you're tapped into your crown chakra and this woman envies. I'm telling you, five by five. Some, you could be going through some type of major transition. Some big changes is coming here soon. Yeah, because somebody was doing wishful thinking, trying to drain your money. Trying to drain somebody's money. Okay, affirmation, you are beautiful. Yeah, this is your past life and this will be your new life. Okay, you could be an older male watching me. I am beautiful. Or older male could be watching you. Okay, somebody fears of losing you here because you're tapped into your solar chakra. Okay, we have Scorpio water signs. I hate you. Fake lover. Okay, so take what resonates. You could be a Scorpio, but there's a fake lover <laughs> that is pretending, right? Throat chakra, Capricorn. Somebody's also trying to block your throat chakra. This person's a loser. Spirit said this person's a loser. Because you're going to keep speaking up. You're going to keep standing up for yourself. Anyway. Yeah, baby mama, baby daddy. This could be somebody's child's mother, child's father. Okay, somebody you can need to get some candles to connect with your spirit guides. You could be, be between the ages 29 and 62. 
Somebody feels like you're going to hell, but no, it's first that you're deserving. You could be an empath, okay? You could be picking up on music. Listen to affirmations. Affirmation, I am thankful. Yeah, but somebody did black magic. This emperor in reverse. Yeah, because you're tapped into your heart chakra. What did I say? You're manifesting. You cannot buy love. Can't buy love. You are more viable than money. Know this. 11-11. Yeah, somebody is going towards a twin flame. Because somebody is a powerful ma manifester. And somebody is really angry. This could be family, cousins. But all of this was a karmic lesson here. Okay, stay prayed up. Prayers, meditation, visualizations. Yeah, third party obsessing over you. Somebody's like, please take me back. But somebody has a lot of blockages. They cannot leave this cycle. I was heavy in the magic they did. Give me one more. Yeah, and you're to an earth angel. Because they was jealous and they can't say. Wow. Do I want to pull any more for you guys? Let me get a Souls Truth card. I'm going to close this out. I got a new one for my collective. So we have, what are the dominant emotions that ruin my life? How do you feel your day, stress or joy, tr trust or anger, anxiety or peace? We have only today right now, the journey, no go, no destination will bring us the feeling we seek. But when we begin feeling every day with that which we value most, we will attract more of it. This is fulfillment. Lean into what you want to feel and adjust your life, your values, and your expectations. Match your desires. What do you want to feel? Are you willing to let go of the belief that you have to achieve something to feel it? Yeah, so I feel like, like I said, <laughs> yellow brick road energy. Finding solutions in the unknown in the dark places. You're not looking for answers. This is why you are on the journey. This is why you are accepting your journey and your path. A lot of people are not going to be able to take a journey they don't know where to go, right? Because a lot of people don't have this much faith to follow God when he is talking to them. <laughs> Everybody is in the energy of listening to other people. But when you listen to your own inner guidance, it takes time for you to actually listen because you have people like karmic family members and situations and people in your life that are on your path that install things in you like, hey, you're dumb or you're a little slow, like something's wrong with you. And you have to literally change this train of thought and start to listen to yourself so it's going to take a while but you don't even have to achieve anything to listen to yourself right to listen to the guidance that god is giving you so this is the energy that's giving me okay that's all i got for you guys love and light namaste i'll